hello guys, it's your boy Babies. Uh, before this video starts, uh, please uh, help me get my goal of 1000 subscribers and uh, like and subscribe. If you uh, want to see any video about uh, or have questions about anything, let me know in the comments and uh, I will answer them or make a video about it. Thank you. Enjoy. Hello guys, it's your boy Babies. Today I'm going to be showing you how to uh, multicolor on your quality K1 or K1, uh, K1 Max. Well, uh, let's see, this is a perfect example. It's a nice uh, screw measuring uh, tool. Uh, you know, you see it's uh, orange and uh, black at the top. I'm going to show you how, uh, how to do this and you just download it. And then uh, once you download it, I uh, just use this one. Download it, perfect. Then you open your Creality uh, Print software. Hit open file. You open it. And then uh, like this, you see it's, it's loaded. Uh, you select your kind of filament and your profile that you normally uh, normally use. You hit uh, hit slice. And when it's sliced, and then you're just gonna look for the layer that you where you want it to uh, to change. And remember, it always starts at one layer below. So uh, I will show you. When I tap in 52 here, you will see actually in the config it says the layer 51. You see it there where my mouse is. Now we're gonna search where only the letters are. So you see the layer 50. This is uh, where it still is the top. So we need to change it on layer 51. And what we're going to do in this situation, we're just going to export it to locally. I'm going to save it. Uh, yes, perfect. Let's save. Then uh, I'm going to open this folder. And uh, you edit uh, the G code. I always use um, Visual Studio Code because I, I think it's really easy, but you can do it with, with any software. Just open it and you see a lot of a uh, lot of lines. So a nice update. Okay, I always hit the uh, Control F. And then now we'll type in a layer. Then we're gonna go all the way down because we want it to change at layer 50 because that's where where it changes. Actually, it says layer 51, but remember it always sets zero, so not on one, so one layer behind it, and the max is layer 51. But it's actually 52 layers. I want to change the layer 50. So we're gonna go all the way down. Almost there. Well, one up. All you have to do, enter and hit right pass. It's an S. And then you, uh, then you just save it. Oh, and then uh, I save, save it. Perfect. Then everything is uh, everything is done. You can close this. You go to prepare. I will uh, I will remove this. Now I will open it again. Then change the mesh file to the G code file actually. Then you open it and it will, will load. And now you will see if I go to a layer 50 it was. Look, actually 51. It also says pause here right now. Then all you have to do is just. Uh, Send it to your printer, your land printing. Go to your device, and then you uh, then you print it. So this is what happens. It will stop. It will pause. You see, it's on pause. It's doing nothing, and it's hovering there. And all you have to do, I'll put my phone a little bit down. You put on the wait one second. Unlock this thing. Boop. Go to the settings. Boop. Extrude. You take make sure it's not hovering above it. Uh, retract. I want to go and get my uh, my clipper. This nice thing. I clip it. Clip. And I get it out. Um, you know this is heating. You will see it's heating. I will change the the roll. Whoop. Ta da Put in the red one. Right through it. Now it's done with trash thing. You just pull it out. Like easy. And I put this new thing one in. One second, I leave both hands for this. Okay, now I have it in. And it will say refill. Yes. 
and I click on extrude. Oop. We go heat again. I'll put the you know red. Right. You see because it's now it's like this. I just let it waiting. I can push it through. Still heating. <laughs> and it's working. Perfect. You see it's turning. I will lock it. Whoop. Making a nice line. And I will cut that off. Now it's done. Now it's red now. And then I just go to the house. And I hit on play. Easy. Now we'll start again. Mm -hmm. Now the new letters. Perfect. You see? And this is the awesome result of white and red. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any questions, uh, leave them below in the comments.